step to my channel. If you're new here, please hit the subscribe button. And if you're returning, hit the likes button and also the bells button if you so that you'll always know when I upload a video. So today, I'm gonna come on and just real quick and make breakfast sandwiches. I got it off of TikTok and their uh, breakfast sandwiches today, they're gonna be made with sausage, egg, cheese, and some green chili, New Mexico green chili. So I'm gonna get everything set up. Once I um, get everything set up, I'll bring you back, let you know from start to finish how it's done. And these are easy breakfast sandwiches that you can put in the freezer and just pull them out. Um, you don't have to bake them if you don't want to, or you can bake them if you um, want to. I think I'm going to try baking a few of them. I might just go ahead and bake all of them, and then they can just be uh, put in the re in the freezer, and then you can just take them out and microwave them. That's an easy meal uh, for you, for especially parents to make in the morning for children. If you don't, uh, your children don't like um, heat as far as chili or anything in there, you can leave that out. You can also do these with bacon, uh, egg, and I thought about that and I thought, let me just do it one way and I'll try the bacon on another day. So let me get started and I'll bring you back. Okay guys, so to the pan, I have added uh, a little bit of olive oil and I have um, added in the uh, Jimmy Dean sausage. And we'll just let this brown up. You can also add maybe onion uh, to it. I thought about maybe potatoes, but that would be too many carbs. And I don't think the potatoes, maybe hash browns, but I just don't think that when you have the bread that the potatoes need to be added. So we're going to let these brown. And while that's browning, I am going to start my eggs and I'm just gonna probably do. I don't. I didn't um, really know how many to do, but I'm gonna. I'm doing. Um, let's see. Fourteen breakfast sandwiches. So I think all of these eggs should be sufficient um, to do. I'm just gonna crack all of them. So I hope everyone's week has been a great week. Today is Thursday and uh, almost ready for the weekend. Make sure you guys go and check us out on Saturday at 6 p.m. California time um, on Straight Talk and Company with Michelle. We're going to have great hot topics on there um, for this Saturday. So please go and check that out. Uh, it will be live. We will be going live. So check that out. We do talk about some interesting topics and just have a fun time. So bring your cocktails, your tea, coffee, whatever you're drinking, and come and join us for our show. Uh, well, not show, but just chit chat with us on some topics, hot topics, all topics, any topics. We're here. You guys will be there for it. So I'm just going to give these a quick mix. Scrabble them up a little bit. To this, I do add a little bit of water. Some people add milk, but water does the same thing. It just kind of fluffs them up. Um, so I'm just going to add a tad bit of water. If I can get my... Just a little. You don't need much. Oops, and my fork got lost. Okay, to that I'm going to add some salt and pepper. Maybe a little garlic salt as well on there just to kind of give it a little bit more flavor. And some pepper. So I'll, I'll leave the salt out since I added the garlic salt to it. Just give that a quick mix. And those are gonna be ready 
once our sausage get done. Please hit the subscribe button, the like button. It really helps the channel out when you um, hit the uh, like and su subscribe button. If you enjoy the content, um, please, you know, it doesn't take anything, doesn't cost anything. It's free for um, free uh, content. I mean, so, you know, what do you have to lose? I do a lot of recipes on this channel. I do, um, like I said, um, cooking. I do um, talking. I do, I do a lot of true crime, uh, the foster care system. Um, we do have the channel, uh, well, not the channel, but the other um, on Saturday nights uh, at 6 p.m. Uh, go check us out. Uh, it's Straight Talk with Michelle and Company. And we just talk about, you know, a lot of the topics or just whatever, you know, whatever you're thinking, we're talking about. So go over there, check that out, and be a part of this channel. I would love to have you. So I'm just going to finish up cooking the sausage, letting that brown. Then uh, when I do the eggs we'll, and get all that together, when I start to roll out the dough, I will bring you back. Oh, also, please... Uh, heat your oven to 350 um, so that and you're gonna cook them for probably about 15 to 20 minutes just to get the rolls done okay guys so the eggs are cooked I mixed the sausage with the eggs and now I am going to take my green chili and add it right in once I drain it a little because you don't want anything wet going into the um, dough because it'll make it soggy so I want to drain it as good as I can and you see the eggs are just they're fluffy so again this is New Mexico green chili this is the mild because I don't want to burn anybody up I love hot hot but Everybody around here has become a little wimpy, so I won't add the hot. Okay, so you just mix that in. I'm gonna let this cool a little bit before I um, sh roll out my dough and, sh and get those in the oven. We'll do a taste test. I can't wait for this taste test. I haven't eaten all day, so this'll be a good little um, small carb for me. I'm not supposed to have them, but I will do it for my viewers. Uh, but anyway, we'll let this cool. And once this cool, then I will bring you back and uh, we'll put it together. Okay, so you're gonna put a little in the middle and then you're gonna pinch the sides up. Make sure everything's stuffed in there. And these are just uh, dinner rolls that I got from uh, Walmart. They come in a big orange thing. They're the um, dinner rolls that you have um, in the frozen section. And I usually get a big bag of these to, for um, Thanksgiving. Now, let me grab another uh, pan and I'll bring you right back. Okay, so what I did is I have a pan here. And I'm gonna place the fold it, fold it side straight, seams down, seam it up, pinch it up, and then put it face down in the pan to bake. I'll do a couple of more. And I think they're gonna come out just fine. I did make a lot of dough, I mean a lot of uh, filling, but like I said, you can, you, you can either freeze it, which I probably won't. I'll probably just have it here and might even make some more of these tomorrow um, to freeze because I've already gotten requests from my family to leave some out so that they could taste them. Now I'm stuffing these a little bit, you know, because I like, I don't want just bread. So I'm gonna pull this over, gather, kind of stretch it out a little bit when you're pulling it. 
And then just make sure that all of the filling and everything is pinched. You wanna get a good pinch on it. And then same side down in the pan, like that. So I'm just gonna continue wrapping these up. Maybe I'll do a couple more with you guys on camera. I seem to get everything right when I'm on camera. <laughs> everything tastes better. Okay, another little pinch. And again, this is great. Oh my gosh, I forgot the cheese. Well, those will be my taster because I'm not really a big on cheese anyway. Everybody would be like, where's the cheese? And here it is. I was like, I know I'm missing something in here. Okay. So, just take, pinch, gather. And then just kind of make sure that everything is, is kind of, you know, pinched together and pinched side down. So I'm gonna keep making these and once they come out of the oven, I'm going to actually um, bring you back when I, because I'm going to melt some butter, brush the top with butter, and then we'll put them in the oven. Okay, guys, so I have them all done and stuffed. And what I thought I'd do is, you could, I mean, regular butter is great, but I have this garlic butter that I'm going to brush the tops of each one with. Just brush them. I might have to, hopefully I have enough butter. And I won't have to heat any more. <laughs> And this is also going to give the, you know, if you're making, I made uh, these rolls just with, you know, plain rolls um, and um, for Thanksgiving. And I brushed them with this butter and it gave it like a nice uh, flavor. I didn't have to put any butter on top or anything else. So, we're going to put these in the oven. I'm going to bake them for 350 until they're done. I'll bring you back once they're done, and we'll do a quick taste test. Okay, guys. So, they are ready. And this is what it looks like. Nice little round. I'll tear it open. It's a little hot. And this is what it looks like in the center. Now it's green chili, bacon, I mean green chili, I'm thinking about bacon. Um, so green chili, egg, and sausage. And I'm gonna try it with bacon as well one of these days. And cheese, and I add it in New Mexico green chili. So I'm interested to see, it's a little hot, how it tastes. Mm. Mm. The best of both worlds. A sandwich, egg, green chili, cheese. Ah. Mm. Delicious. Very good. So try these. I got it off TikTok. Um, they didn't have the green chili. I did that twist myself. <clears throat> but try them but if you're new here please hit the subscribe button and and the likes button and if you're returning hit the likes button also hit the bells button so that you know whenever i upload a video and i will be live on saturday with straight talk uh and company with straight talk with michelle and company on saturday at 6 p.m we're gonna go live we're gonna talk about a lot of different topics 
you will enjoy. So bring your drinks, coffee or tea, and, or you can even bring dinner. But see you there um, on Saturday at 6 p.m. Again, like, comment, share, and subscribe. And thank you all so much for watching. Bye.